All right, everybody, hello. Today we are pretty much ditch fishing, but we're gonna see if there's any fish trapped in here. I know that sometimes when the water gets low, not all the fish make it out. And uh, there's a little shallow spot right here, so they may be stuck right in here. We got worms and we got chicken liver, so catfish and whatever else we can catch. Let's see if there's some fish in here, let's go. I'm just gonna be standing because my guess is if there's fish in here, it's not gonna take very long for them to bite. First cast, little worm. That would be a baby tilapia. Uh, I know they're pretty hated here. This is actually not the first tilapia I've caught. Ow. No skunk. We caught a fish out of the puddle. <laughs> We're gonna put that worm back down there and see if maybe we can get another one. Hopefully not a tilapia though. Right about there. The tilapia did get me though. I don't know if you can see that. Didn't realize they had so many spikes. Picking. We got him. Oh, we had him. We had him. Okay, we got a school of something down here. We got him that time. And it is a another tilapia, of course. I should have known. Well, you can catch fish in a ditch here that's for sure on the side of the road in arizona uh i know these tilapia get a lot bigger like the size of dinner plates we just got these little guys for now i wonder how fun that'd be on a bobber let's see if we got a bobber make it a little more interesting first cast with the bobber picked we got one <laughs> that easy that easy guys float a bobber catch a tilapia okay he doesn't want to be seen well let's see if we can do that again we got him oh, oh that was bigger that was bigger right there. Dang it. We got him. We got him. Another tilapia. This is the biggest one of the day, I think, so far. But hey, it's a fish, and it's in a literal puddle. Okay, he's feisty, he doesn't want to be seen. He's gonna flop all the way back into the water. Oh, I know they're not the size that we're looking for, but these guys are kind of fun to catch. I really want to get one of those big ones. And I'm sure if we stay here long enough, we might. Let's do this. They seem to be right. Uh, that wasn't the right cast, but I'm sure there's one over there. Oh. Come on, man. Gotta get him this time. I don't think he really felt what was going on. But. Huh. Of course, when I'm not recording, there is our first bass of Arizona, actually. I've never caught a bass in Arizona until now. Same puddle. We just been plucking them out of there, guys. Let them go. All right. This little section seems stacked. I want to leave, but I just keep getting bites. Oh, something's got it. He is taking it, too. Let's let him take it into that pipe. Maybe. We got him. We got him. Feels a little better. A little better. What do we got? I have not seen it yet. Oh, I think it's a bigger bass. I think it's a bigger bass. 
Yes, it is. Ooh, I don't know how we're gonna land this one. We're just gonna have to kind of pray that <laughs> he doesn't come off while we lift him. We only have four pound test. Oh, we got him. Nice. Well, that was kind of cool. We got ourselves our first decent size Arizona bass. Let me clean them off a little bit here. There's our first decent bass of Arizona. Caught in this little puddle right here, man. That is actually crazy. All right. Well, that was pretty cool. Let's let them go. I think I'm gonna end this one here. Hope you guys enjoyed us catching fish out of this tiny little puddle. 